Good morning, and welcome to your top stories today on Volt News Network. Elon Musk has introduced a new artificial intelligence chatbot named Grok for some users of Twitter. This is the first product from his new AI startup company, XAI, just two months after founding it. Grok is positioned as a rival to other AI chatbots like ChatGPT, Bard, Claude, and others. In developing Grok, Musk aims to address his concerns about the focus on profitability by large tech companies who create AI rather than safety. Grok is designed to answer questions with humor and has access to Twitter's real-time data to stay current, which Musk claims gives it an advantage. Ohio voters approved a measure legalizing recreational marijuana, making it the 24th state to do so. A 10% tax will be imposed on sales to fund administrative costs and programs related to addiction treatment, local governments, and supporting the marijuana industry. As a citizen-initiated statute, the law is still subject to legislative changes or even repeal, though political stakes are now higher. Opponents will continue fighting commercial sales, advertising, and production allowances. Supporters urge lawmakers to promptly enact the voter-approved law. In nerdy news, Nintendo has announced it is developing a live-action film based on its iconic video game franchise, The Legend of Zelda. The film will be co-produced by Nintendo and Sony Pictures Entertainment. Nintendo president Shuntaro Furukawa expressed confidence in the project, noting work has been going on for over a decade. Veteran Nintendo executive Shigeru Miyamoto echoed this sentiment, stressing the film will only be released when it is ready. Nintendo is looking to further leverage its popular intellectual properties through various mediums like films, theme parks, merchandise, and more. This comes as the Super Mario Bros. animated film was a huge box office success, generating over a billion dollars in revenue. Thanks for watching. This has been Volt News Network. Have a great rest of your day and tune in later on for your top stories tonight. See ya!